speedboat killer Jack Shepard is to be sent back to the UK after agreeing to his extradition from Georgia. The 31-year-old went on the run before his trial where he was found guilty of manslaughter following a speedboat crash on the River Thames which killed Charlotte Brown. After months in hiding in the capital, Tbilisi, he handed himself into police and was jailed for three months. Shepard has been granted the right to appeal against his UK conviction. The court heard Shepard's extradition order was based on both the manslaughter offence and a separate assault charge. The second charge relates to an incident, shortly before Shepard fled to Tbilisi, in Moynton Hampstead, Devon, on 16 March 2018. Shepard is accused of causing grievous bodily harm with intent. Defence lawyers said Shepard agreed to be extradited, but only if his safety was taken into consideration by the judge. Speaking before the hearing, his lawyer, Mariam Kablashvli, told Rustavi 2 TV Shepard feared for his safety in the UK. She said, because of the attitude of the British media and public he truly does not feel himself to be human. Outlining the extradition case, prosecutor Naniko Zazunashvili argued there was nothing to prevent Shepard being sent back to the UK. M. Zazunashvili said, he knew the boat was not in good working order and knew Charlotte Brown had no skills to control the boat, and he let her control the boat. While being on board the boat Jack Shepard took obligation to take care of Charlotte Brown, but this obligation was violated. He knew boat was in poor working order. We are sure that if he is extradited there will be no threat to his life. Shepard met Ems Brown online and they went on a date on 8 December. He invited her to go on a speedboat ride. They were thrown from the boat when it hit branches in the water near Wandsworth Bridge at about midnight. Ems Brown, from Clacton on CNS6, was found in the water unconscious and un-